Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. A table is only useful if it has a system or pattern to its storage of data. You'll usually keep a table sorted by one or more columns of information. You can sort tables by letters or numbers that they contain, and the reason for this should be fairly obvious. For example, if you had a table that contained all the capitals of the 50 states, you wouldn't want to have to search through the entire table just to find the one state you're looking for. But if it was alphabetically ordered by state, you could immediately look up the state in alphabetical order, and then just look down the row to find the capital. So sorting in words pretty easy to do. What you'd want to do is just put the cursor anywhere in the table that you want to sort. Then choose Table from the menu bar and select the Sort command. If your table has titles as the first row in your table, you can easily sort the table using the header names. If you have not included headers, just select the column number by which you want to sort the data. You choose whether your list has a header row, as it's called, or no header row, down at the bottom of the sort dialog box. If you choose header row, it uses the values in the first row by which you can select how to sort. So here, let's say we're going to sort by first name, which is text, and then using ascending or descending order. Then by, let's say, last name, which is also text, in ascending or descending order. Then let's say we want to sort by date. And here that's a date. Let's choose descending order, so the most recent are at the top. Whenever you had chosen your sort orders, and you don't have to use all three, although you can certainly use up to three, click OK and you'll see it applied. If you wanted to reverse the sort, say do a last name, first name, once again, click into the table, choose table and sort, choose your header row or no header row, and just change the fields used for the sorting. If you wanted to remove one that you had applied, notice you could use the drop down and choose none to disable it, and then click OK to apply it. So now we should be sorting last name, first name. Also, you can sort by an individual column by simply clicking into a column by which you would like to sort, and then clicking either the Sort Ascending or Sort Descending buttons in the Tables and Borders toolbar. Now if you select a single column, be aware because making selections like that first and then clicking sort can sometimes destroy the relationship of the data in this particular column with its rows. So usually it's just simply enough to click into a cell within the column by which you want to sort and then just simply click sort ascending or sort descending for those quick single column sorts. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.